So I just wanted to talk a bit today about trail runners. They're becoming a bigger trend when people are going on ultralight hiking, ultralight backpacking, um, doing longer trails like um, the Appalachian Trail. Um, with the advent of adventure racing, a lot of people are turning away from the traditional hiking boot and choosing something a bit lighter, a bit more flexible, like a runner, but with a bit more of a sturdiness. These are uh, Adidas Canadia Trail Runner 3. Um, on the bottom you have a, a lot bigger tread, something that's going to give you a lot better traction on the trail for off-road running, but a lot of people are using them for backpacking and they've been recommended for carrying packs under 50 pounds. Um, one of the downside is you don't have as much ankle support. There's a little trick that a lot of people don't know. If you look here, you've got two holes right beside each other. Um, and they've been put there for a special purpose. What they are is that they're to tighten up the top rim to give you more ankle support. You take your shoelace and you bring it through the inside of the first hole and then you push it through the outside of the other hole and leave a small space, put your finger in there, and do the same thing with the other side. Then what you're going to want to do is put the opposite lace through that little eye on either of them. And what's going to happen then is you've got two strings that you can cinch up and pull really tight. So it's a um, really good way for ankle sport. I learned it from a, a shoe store. So it's been designed that way and it's really useful to give you that extra bit of support when you're hiking, when you're backpacking, or even just when you're running. I use these shoes um, to go up Iyamani um, when I tried to, to hit the summit. And they're very good, very comfortable. Um, I didn't break them in enough, so it was a bit sore, but, uh, but now I don't, I don't have much of a problem at all. With this specific model, it's, it's, a, it's an entry level um, trail runner. And it, it costs, even down here in Bolivia, less than $60. So um, something that you could pick up probably for a lot cheaper in North America. And um, it's going to do a really good job on the trails.